resilience. I think, and this is why there's obviously a massive debate at the moment about recruiters working from home. Um, recruitment is, and I'll be very open about this, is the best job in the world. Um, I genuinely think it's the best job in the world, and but it's also the worst job in the world. There are days where you are very down, and you know, you, things usually come in threes, and they're usually for where you don't expect them. Um, so I think from a from a business perspective, I think it's important. Firstly, we need to get people in the office, and Hamilton Barnes were 100% work from the office and all that kind of stuff, because if you are having that bad day and you are at home, home is very lonely. You know, you haven't got anybody you can bounce off or anybody sees you at the coffee machine and goes, mate, how are you? You look miserable. And you can have a little bit of a laugh about it and pick each other up. Um, so I think the it almost it doesn't necessarily come back to humor, but it's more that kind of team spirit and company spirit that will help build resilience. We've all had those days where it's gone. Wow. Like it's been really bad today really bad but you can all have a little bit of a laugh about it and go nobody died so it's all right you know like the end of the day like we're trying to do everything that we can some things you can't you know you just you don't expect and you could never ever have prepared for but i think as a as a recruitment agency it's really important that we can basically give people an environment that they can flourish in make it a really positive environment as well um and also just you know teach recruiters to be able to get back up you know the, the the most successful recruiters are the ones that can you know look for somebody for a week find somebody they accept the role get counter offered stayed and then do it again the following week you know um and it doesn't happen that often but sometimes you can have to do that two to three times which uh yeah could be quite scary but it doesn't always happen like that but you know you have to be able to build resilience into your business because if it does <laughs> what you don't want is people you know that actually could be great recruiters and after two three months of working with you they get you know a couple of instances like that they're working from home they go i don't want to do recruitment anymore and i always think recruitment could get a bad rap if it's done poorly 